Now, I don't hand off the book writing to somebody else. I don't hand off the radio to somebody. I don't hand off all this stuff. Now, I have teams that help me in radio and Landmark and, and Levin TV, I, I, obviously. But I'm in charge, and I have to do it. And I want to do it. I hope you'll check out LevinTV.com. LevinTV.com. Mark Levin is not a Trump fan. I think he's a Ben Carson fan. And I'm a Ben Carson fan. I really hope Ben Carson stays in there, sticks in there, and beats the competition. Because I think he's the only one that's truthful. The only one who would try to, you know, do good and uh, try to erase the horrible stuff that uh, O'Blamer has done. He would fix race relations. He would uh, take off, it. He'd, he'd remove that horrible taste that O'Blamer left in our mouths, if you know what I mean. So I am really hoping Ben Carson sticks it out and wins. Because I don't trust anyone except Ben Carson. If it comes down to it, okay, I'll vote for, vote for Trump. But I sure hope I don't have to. I'd rather vote for Ben Carson. Dr. Ben Carson. He may not be the smartest person in the world, but he... I can see him trying to do the right thing. That's good for America. Good for freedom good cons for conservative values not for big government and stuff like that I say Ben Carson he, he I mean for one thing he came <laughs> he, he beat incredible odds to become who he was a brain surgeon you know uh, went from you know stabbing people and whatever to doing the right thing so hey I say Ben Carson, Ben Carson. Oh, I hope he wins. <laughs>